off with the colors They kinda tell me what I'm thinking I fell in love with the way we are And the way we lose it There's something different about us And the reason why we stay Hi friends I've been busy all morning working on different things that I didn't know if it seemed interesting like laundry right behind me <laughs> I don't know why I get myself into these things I just start working on like the weirdest projects I guess I'm betting my car is done charging I didn't use it much yesterday oh no my phone with me can't unplug it but I came out to get some, I don't even know now what I came out here for but I noticed this bag on the counter here um, and it has just all the la random like birthday stuff from Abby's birthday um, and it was just sitting on top of this little party box that I have and I was like oh I should put it away and then I shouldn't just put this bag inside I should actually like organize it and then I started organizing everything oh it had like lemonade stand stuff in it this is the set of napkins I had the girls take out for their lemonade stand um, they didn't do any of this I sent it with Jason <laughs> he didn't put any of it up that day um, but now I feel like I should like organize this whole bin should I should I, I don't even know but if I'm gonna do that like I want to sit and organize it and I don't want to do that here in the garage Half the time I find stuff later and I'm like, oh, I had that. I didn't need to buy it. So we're going to take this inside and we're going to organize it. Um, Jason's birthday is next month. I don't do a ton of like, you know, decorations or anything for his birthday. But there is something in here I was looking to see if I have before I go buy it. Um, try and like, even just like regular gift bags. I do have some presents to give him. Um, but I just wanted to like see what gift bags I have if I just have like neutral. I have a lot of girl bags. Um, okay, so let's just take this inside. Hi, welcome to my day. <laughs> this is what I end up getting into. I actually, you'll be proud of me. I was just putting away laundry in my bedroom and decluttered another section of my closet since it's the end of summer. My swimsuits and workout stuff that... Um, I no longer need. I thought maybe, I don't, I don't know what I thought when I did my other declutter, but I don't need any of it. It's too big. It literally can't fit into anything. But when I was going through that, I found a sports bra. The very bottom of my swim stuff, which it doesn't belong there, um, <laughs> it is a size that I have not been in a very long time. In a bra, I should say. Um, and I was like, hmm, I've been wanting a tighter fitting sports bra. The one I ended up getting from Shaper Mint, is that what I got from? Um, it, it works, it's just not a kind of a, a sports bra. And I'm not doing the kind of workout that I need a kind of bra for yet. But I've been wanting to do that. And I tried this bra on today and it was like, I was so proud of myself. I was like, it fits so good and it snugged the ladies up. So kudos to me for actually like finding a random chore to do this morning when I was putting away laundry because I found myself a sports bra. It's in the wash. But um, we're going to take this in and we're just doing random projects today, I guess. Um, there's no rhyme or reason for me to need to do this today, but I might as well because I'm bored. I asked my friend <laughs> earlier today, I'm not going for a walk, I don't know why, maybe I will later, but um, I asked her, I was like, do you want to just go get drinks and sit in the car and talk? <laughs> and she's like, let me take a nap, and I had a rough night, let me take a nap, and uh, we'll, we'll see you later. So if, you, if she's watching this later, <laughs> just know that that made my day. Even if we just think about going to do that, having another friend who is willing to go sit in a car and just talk, that's a good friend. All right, it seems daunting, but it's actually probably not gonna be too bad. I've already seen that I've started to try and like, you know, organize stuff. These are all my little lanterns. Um, got a bag of stuff. 
loose confetti is it looks like what that is and balloons so we're gonna pull everything out that's how I do things you pull everything out this is I do this 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 is the kind of stuff I get these basket bags I love these things from the dollar store and then I'm like oh I don't know if I have any and I'm at the dollar store and I get get more and guess what I still have some at home so <laughs> I'm gonna pile these up and see how many I have let's let's see how many of those I have and then gift bags oh this has the little um, gift bags that we use for cheer so um, that we don't buy those again okay let's see what we can come up with okay um, <laughs> it's so funny um, I this is where I'm at with it now I'm kind of having to hurry I'll, I'll show you all my little piles so far but my friend just texted me and she's like okay I'm ready let's go let's go to Target Let's go sit in our car. Let's go get a drink. So now I have to hurry and put this away um, so that it's not in the way. Okay, so I'll finish this really quick. But I've got um, like paper plate napkin supplies here and then tablecloths. I don't know why I have so many random tablecloths. A stack of tissue paper, which is perfect. I have these leaves from like, you know, Hawaiian birthday themes. I have all that confetti and actually like this, this stuff. That's tissue. We'll put that with the tissues. Um, and then I have just these random, um, oh, actually the gift bags could go in here too. Yep, I have a gift bag pile right here. And I have more inside here. Because you never use like every one of them that come in a pack. And so that's what the random ones are in there. It's just the leftovers, but they can still be used. This is a pile of balloons. Leftover from balloon arches, balloon kits, balloon tape, all that kind of balloon dots. Um, all of that is totally handy. Then that bag has the little um, lanterns in it. And then this is a birthday garland. And then, yes, I have found one, two, three, four packs of these um, basket bags. So that's eight basket bags. <laughs> I clearly did not need to keep buying those at the dollar store. And then here I have the pile of uh, gift bags. So, yeah, they're all girly and Eastery. I, this this one here could pull off for boys the blue and white polka dot um, and I've got a few more in here um, my kids won't let me do Hawaiian themes <laughs> for their birthday parties anymore but I just love these bags I loved when I found these at um, the dollar store years ago um, I just love them so much but we'll get other use out of them so I'm gonna keep sorting through I'm almost done all right this already feels so good so I have all my gift bags right here. These are balloon stakes where you can put it into the ground and attach the balloon knot to the top. Um, and then I'm gonna put my tissue paper. I always have to get to the tissue paper. Oh goodness sakes. So I'm gonna put that in here. Okay, we have gift bags, we have tissue paper. Clearly don't have any white, so I might need to stock up on white. See this pack right here comes with like two pieces of white. I have two of them left, three of them left, but I take out the white and then I'm left with all these um, green and blue sets. But I probably got these from Target and they're probably 90% off. So they were probably like 10 cents each. Nope, they were 30 cents each. They were probably 90% off, $3. So it's worth having it when I have a random gift that it doesn't matter what the, you know, the tissue paper is. <laughs> um, but then down here I've got the tablecloths um, all the paper plates, napkins, and then I have a tiki, like the Hawaiian theme party kit in this little Ziploc bag. I have that there. Then I've got all of the balloons. They're all from different random um, garland sets. I've got all of those in here. And then I've got all the little kits that go with those. And I'm just gonna stack, oh, this is a cute little cupcake liners. They're, I got them from my friend, wood grain cupcake wraps. That's kind of fun. If I have like a themed party, I can use that. Maybe I'll put that in here. So I'm gonna organize this bag here just a little bit because it's kind of random stuff. This is a sunflower garland. I actually use this. Um, sunflowers is a thing for my mom. So at the first granddaughter days, um, grandkid days, after my mom had passed, um, we did a sunshine theme. So that was from the garland, the balloon garland that we did for that. So I always want to keep that and use it again. And then we have that. And then we have the lanterns. So I think we did pretty good. Um, oh, and these little um, 
gift bags. So I'm going to keep those on top because this is what I tend to like rebuy at the dollar store that I don't actually need. So, yep, that one's organized. We're going to organize this one. We're just going to stick that in there. Maybe I'll find a bag for that one or like a Ziploc bag, which I actually need to get. I'll show you in a second. I need to get Ziploc bags at Target. So it's perfect that I'm going to go there and then I'll organize this. Oh, I also have this bag with all of the bows that I buy. I save them. I'm kind of a cheapskate, but they can be reused. I never really tape them on too tight, but I just have them all in here. They were kind of loose and getting all over the place and I never knew what colors I had. And now I can tell we also have some streamers. I have pink, blue, and white in here. So battery died, sorry. This is all in this bag and we're gonna organize that one. And then I think I'm set to go. I think we're good. And there you have it. I organized these. I have a six and an O. I don't know <laughs> when I'm going to use a six and an O balloon. Um, then I have my birthday light up sign here. And then I just have a bunch of little confetti and confetti bags left over from different parties. So never know when those are going to come in handy. I also have a one and a six from Abby's birthday. Um, but I've got gift bags, tissue papers. I ended up putting all of those little plastic bags into a Ziploc bag and then the little cupcake things here. So it all tucks in nicely and I have just enough. Oh, and I forgot my little leaves. We'll just tuck those in. So tucks into this little guy. A lot of people put this underneath their bed. I don't do anything like that. I don't store things under my bed. Um, I use this out of the garage all the time. So this is a way better solution for me. So we also had one random piece of wrapping paper. I used to put the wrapping paper in there, but it wasn't long enough. Oh goodness sakes. So it goes in here, but sneak peek at baby supplies right there. So <laughs> we're going to leave that there. I'll figure that out later. I need a box. I need to put all those decorations um, in a box to take with me to my sister's baby shower. So maybe I'll, I'll text Jason, see if he has anything random from the store. So I think we're perfectly timed to run to Target. Um, I don't need, I mean, I'm always at Target, so I don't need very much. But when I went to get the bag out, I have a, a few Ziploc bags in the gallon size left from this little box. And then I found just a few quart size bags, but then the rest are gone. And I accidentally got um, sandwich bags. That they're the fold clothes. You can't have fold clothes here. I don't know if I'm gonna donate that, but like things need to get cinch closed, <laughs> like zipper closed here. The moisture in our air, you have to have it zip closed. So um, I'm gonna go get one of these boxes at Target. If they don't have it, I probably will just buy like sandwich bags and snack bags. Like these two sizes, I have enough quart bags to last for a little while. So, and, and gallon bags, but I love this box at Target. Also, I was like, why is the oven on? And it's because Abby likes to make brownies at all times of the day. All right, now we are pulling in and I'm picking up, I think I'm picking her up. And we're gonna go to Target and then we're gonna go get a beverage. We both like our beverages in the car. <laughs> you have to find friends like this. I don't know if she was done shopping or checking out. So we're gonna circle around here and see where she's at. Okay, we just spent hours talking. Oh my gosh, I'll show you the few things that I did get at Target. I have M&Ms, or not M&Ms, I have chocolate chips here in the car to keep them cold so that they didn't melt while we sat and talked. Um, but I also got some checks and uh the peanut butter checks <laughs> because the muddy buddies that abby made um were so good and so i'm gonna have her make them again so i got more chocolate chips and then the checks mix or checks peanut butter checks and then i got the um what do you call it the baggy box from target but then we've been sitting in the park and having our our drinks <laughs> she's like oh my gosh why don't we do this more often um, we just had so much to talk about and get caught up on. That was so much fun. It's just what I needed. Like I needed a friend 
to talk and cry and laugh with. It was just so, you know who you are, so thank you. Um, but now I'm gonna head home, everyone's like, where are you? <laughs> I'm like, don't you know? I'm sitting in the park with a drink. Um, just added a friend this time. So I'm gonna run home and um, yeah, I didn't, I'm not gonna take time. Did I tell you already that I decluttered part of my closet? I have another bag of clothes that don't fit me anymore. So <laughs> I'm not gonna go over to um, the Goodwill place today. Um, but I will do that another day. But I have a whole nother trash bag of clothes that don't fit me. And I'm excited to get rid of them. Um, and, oh, Ashley has cheer. She has cheer coming up soon. Her second squad is actually starting next week. And she is going to be a busy girl. She's gonna be so tired from all of her squads. And I actually just, I think she was invited to be on the competitive squad, the third squad that she's on for her other set of cheering. Um, the ones that do the stunt and tumble and the, you know, the putting them up into different pyramids and whatnot. I think she got put onto that squad at the end of their season and they didn't have any more competitions. And I always wondered why they kept calling it the competitive squad if they weren't going to competitions. We were only going to games as a whole and performing at half times. But I just got an email from that squad and they're like, okay, these are when these competitions are. I'm like, oh, they really <laughs> do have competitions because we just weren't on it from the beginning. And so now I have to like schedule out all these actual competitions and the performances, but she's still on her squad doing football cheer. <laughs> I mean, she's only 10, but she's taking off with it. And I've just, I've told her, I'm like, you're going to be busy and you're going to be tired. I think this is what's ultimately going to get her to be, start going to bed at, you know, before 10 PM every night. Cause she's going to come home and be so, so tired, which I'm secretly kind of excited about because <laughs> the girl needs to go to bed sooner. So I'm just going to go home and that was the perfect day. That was so much fun. And I didn't have anything else that I had to do. And so I don't feel like um, I wasn't productive today. I can't even see me. Sometimes when I do this kind of stuff and I just sit and chat with friends, whether it's just on the phone or Marco Polo with my sister or something, you, uh, you kind of feel guilty, especially as a mom, like, like you weren't productive or you didn't, you know, what is it from the movie? You didn't, oh, Bed of Roses. You didn't participate, you didn't contribute to the national, uh, I don't know what it is. You know, you didn't contribute to society or you weren't productive. You didn't do laundry or whatever. But it's okay to just talk to someone. It's okay to just <laughs> have that be your product productivity because we need to have connections with people. And sorry, there's just not good light. <laughs> but it felt so good. And now I'm just like more, re more rejuvenated to be able to go home and take care of my kids. I'm actually be home in like 15 minutes and I'll just be more ready to like be there for them tonight um, because I've gotten a chance to like refresh myself and have a good friend to talk to so hi hi Chels hey can you look at Ashley's closet for her squad goals cheer t-shirt the black one okay she forgot to put it on. I kept telling her to get ready for cheer, get ready for cheer. Strawberry shortcake is not ready for cheer. Where did she? Well, I thought I, I don't know. I mean, if it's clean, then it's hung up. Cause I don't think I have. Squad cheer? Squad goals, uh, black t-shirt, black with squad goals written on it. There's too many shirts. Well, there's only gonna be one or two black ones in there. Look for it for oh, me. Da, da, da. She saves the day with the wrong shirt because the other one's not clean. Whoops, I went too far. That's the shirt I found. Yeah, she doesn't have the right one clean, which is not our fault. So, uh -huh. thank you for bringing it down to me. Zabby making more muddy buddies. She is. They're so good. One of my friends is like, what are those? And then I'm like, muddy buddies. How do, how do people not know about them? Know. They lead sad lives. <laughs> <laughs> Who is that? Alley. Did she try them? You need to take her a small baggie of it tomorrow and and tell. Like, I told her what it was. I was like, man, that kind of sounds good. <laughs> I know, right? 
Oh, you didn't before you could share it. All right. All right. We'll talk to you later. Okay, bye. bye. There's a certain someone's changing <laughs> into the wrong shirt, but still black. Better yep. than strawberry shortcake. Correct? Okay. Bye. Bye. I love you. Thing where with stickers, and if you got enough stickers, you could call it quarter of the game. Oh, yeah. Did you get enough stickers? I had two, but there's three. I don't know if she explained that well. She got they have a reward system with stickers, and if they got the most amount of stickers, they got to be the one calling out the cheers at the games for the one quarter, for the first quarter. Well, we were doing this rock paper scissors. I thought it should have been a vote because, like, because the coaches don't always see what we do for the other people yeah. on the team, and so the other team members do. So I felt like it was meant to be a team. Thing, but yeah. it ended up being rock, paper, scissors. Anyway, so what you just got from your coach? A cooling pad that goes like around your neck. A cooling towel. Yeah. You get it wet and then you wrap it around your neck. Yeah. You're probably only gonna have one more game where you actually want to be cooled off at the game. Except for <laughs> she. But yeah, their their coach is so sweet. She bought them. I don't think the cheer budget had that. I don't think she used the cheer budget. I think she bought them for the girls because it has been so, so hot. Um, but I think this is one of our last game days where it's going to be hot. We might still have hot weather for practices for another two weeks or so, but um, I sat in the parking lot for the hour because by the time I got her shirt, we only had an hour left in practice. So I sat and looked at TikTok. I found another hack. It has to do with grapes and how to get them off of the stems. <laughs> they ate. They hate, they love and hate when I find TikTok no, hacks. No, it's just like how you And know, I like, haven't told you, I I bought something on the TikTok shop for the first time. Well, you built Look at that look, the, look at that look. She's it's like, just like how you think you're like a genius for finding out on TikTok. I don't think I'm a genius. You're like, guess what I found? I found this hack and I bought it. <laughs> yeah, but some of these things like, what, how is You thought I, the milk how? dispenser was so like, okay. good. Well, I know that that one's a fail. Okay, but I have my first TikTok shop purchase coming in the mail next week. Um, when it comes, if I'm gone, um, you can't open it. What is it? I'm gonna surprise you what with it. What is it? I'm not telling you. What? Mm -mm. Yes. Nope. nope, nope, nope. And oh, so, okay, regardless, yeah. we're gonna end our night here with you guys. Um, Jason and I are gonna go and do something really, really fun tomorrow with our friends. And this one is probably the most mad that I'm going to do it without her. Don't say what it is. You know what I'm doing. Mm -hmm. You don't? Well, she's about to find out. It's gonna be really, really fun. Something neither Jason and I have ever done before. Oh. Something very nice Washingtonian. Um, and we haven't done it. And it's gonna be really, really fun. So stay tuned to find out what we do tomorrow. It's gonna to take a majority of our day. Um, what is it? Just bleep it out. Sorry. No. Just so. bleep it out. <laughs> I should make her wait till tomorrow morning no. as well. Because we're leaving right after I get you on the bus. What is it? <laughs> we'll be back probably right when you get home from school. Stay tuned. Find out what we're doing and to see how annoyed she is <laughs> that we're going to do it while she's at school. What is it? Take care, you guys. <laughs> we'll see you later. I, I like driving my kids crazy. Good night. Easy, easy on our tiptoe. Cover agents of the other